Yeah, you know, I, I know some people are afraid of glandular extracts or animal extracts. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, do you think that type of fear is founded? It's it's actually reasonable, or is that just you know over <laughs> over yeah. something? Well, that's... what are they afraid of? Um, let's say cerebral lysin, and, and I have encountered patients who said, "Oh, I'm, 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 what's in it? You know, what pig's brain? Okay, um, you know, what could the, you know, how can we make sure that it's completely there's no prions safe? and stuff like yeah, that? Yeah. So, so oh, look, I mean, in the case of cerebral lysin, I think that they go through extensive testing to make sure that whatever they're using is clean. Um, in the case of the bioregulators, again, they are, I think the process is extremely sophisticated. And, you know, if you, last time I heard Kevinson speak, he was like, you know, we've treated millions of people and nobody's ever had an adverse reaction mm -hmm. ever. Right. Yeah. Um, right. So I think that the process that they use on the, so this is on the nutritional one, which is, which is the actual extract from the tissue gland and organ. When you get to the synthesized bioregulator, there's no issues because it's synthetic, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. The third version, which we don't get here, we don't, you wouldn't find it really outside of Russia as far as I can, as I, as far as I've seen. I mean, I think that, I think I know someone who's brought in a little bit on occasion for doctors, but it's very hard to get into the country because now what we're doing, what they've done is they've taken that, that extract from the tissue gland and organ, and they've created a, 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 an injectable form that, that is injected intramuscularly. Mm -hmm. And that would be, I would think that I would say that in Russia, that would be what they would use as a first intervention. Let's say if someone has a stroke or they have like a very serious medical condition, because that would be the most fast acting, most powerful form of the bioregulator. The synthetic form is the next uh, the synthetics those are very fast acting, but they tend to be, they don't, the, the, the effects don't last quite as long. The, the oral ones, they're not as fast acting, but they, once they kick in, mm. the effects last a lot longer. And it kind of makes sense, right? Because mm -hmm. you've got on the synthetic side, you're just flipping a switch on the, on the biological side, you've got this flip switch flipper, but you also have all the other cofactors that are maybe helping in other ways. Um, the system.